New at 10, Jennings residents upset over an out-of-service elevator at a three-story senior living apartment building. Residents say the elevator has been down for 10 days. Fox 2's Kelly Hoskins looks into why it's taking so long to make the repairs as frustrated residents voice their concerns. Well, Jennings Place is a senior living facility, and many of the people who live here are with walkers or wheelchairs, and they say they are frustrated that the elevator has been down for weeks. Some seniors at the Jennings Place in one of its buildings say the elevator hasn't worked for 10 days. We keep getting notices that tomorrow they're waiting on parts. And it's expensive, but it remains out of order. Brenda Young, who lives in the apartment building which houses 55 senior residents, say the repairs need to be made for safety reasons. It is a stress, especially on the people who live on the second or third floor. It's kind of hard to watch when you see elderly people coming down the stairs steps backwards. This photo was given to our news crew by a resident. Oh, it shows a notice posted on the elevator that says out of service scheduled for maintenance. The apartment complex spokesperson says the elevator stopped working after the building was struck by lightning and has been out of service since July the 10th. Now we confirmed there were thunderstorms in the area on that day. Now the company released the following statement and it reads in part. We are doing everything we can to make sure that the elevator is repaired as quickly as possible. And within hours of the lightning strike that damaged the elevator circuit boards, management had already contracted with a vendor to troubleshoot the problem. And when we learned of the difficulty sourcing circuit boards, we pushed to find alternative sourcing to make the repairs quicker. A concerned family member who did not want to be identified says his mother lives there and says some of the residents suffer from several medical conditions, primarily getting around in motorized wheelchairs, unable to walk up and down the building stairs. I've actually witnessed what residents in wheelchairs. If something was to break out in there and the place needed to be evacuated, that would pose a major problem for some of the residents. Well, the residents here at Jennings Place say they are hoping that that part for the elevator will arrive very soon so they can get back to living normally. Reporting in Jennings, Kelly Hoskins, Fox 2 News.